Guys, I'm struggling to find the perfect place to record this video. Our garage is a mess. Um, but unfortunately, it's literally the only place that has good lighting. So y'all are just going to have to bear with me because my room is too small for me to do this video. Like, oh, I tried to find the perfect angle, but it's just not working out. So yeah i'm gonna have to just use the garage so please bear with me for this video <laughs> hey guys and welcome back to my youtube channel if you're a returning subscriber Welcome back to me. Thank you so much. And if you are new, hi, my name is Amo Moachi. If you do not know who I am, and yeah, welcome to this channel. I hope you love it here, and I hope you show me your love by clicking that red subscribe button and joining this family. So, guys, today I'm finally doing the unboxing of my stroller slash car seat. But before I get into the actual unboxing, I just want to discuss why. I specifically chose um, this car seat or rather the stroller but you know what yeah no I'm back in my room there was some weird noises in the in the in the garage oh guys I'm losing my breath so much lately but anyway so the reason why I specifically choose chose who choose the reason why I specifically chose the junior stroller is mainly because number one space right so my car is not big at all i don't have much boot space um so i wanted something that is like compact easy to use um pretty much like an on the go type of stroller or other car seat so that's the main reason why i went for it and then um second of all i also chose it in the color flame red because of my car's interior so my car's interior is a black and red right so it's like black leather with some red stitches um so i chose the stroller in black and red specifically because i was like baby girl's gonna have to match her mama you know what i mean so <laughs> so that's part of the reason and also i didn't want to go for like um a pink one guys just in case my child comes out and it's a boy like that would be kind of awkward but anyway yeah so i didn't want to go for a pink i like the emerald green but like i mentioned i just i just didn't like um that it wasn't gonna match my car's interior mostly <laughs> and um yeah what is the other reason like i mentioned it's on the go so yeah i think maybe let's rather get into the unboxing so that you understand what i mean yeah, so let's do that. I'm going to go back to the garage now. So if there's a bit of like weird noises in the background, guys, I'm so sorry. But like I mentioned, that's the only spacious place in this house that I can try do this video. The lounge, our lounge area is like dark. And I tried by all means to like, you know, get the lighting right and all that stuff. But it was just not working. So yeah, the garage is going to have to be. So let's go. So yes, this is it guys. As you can see, it says from car seat to stroller in seconds. So basically, we can go from that to that within seconds, right? Um, I also got the isofix base or car seat base as other people call it. Um, just so I don't have to use a seat belt in the car to basically, um, what do you call it? To basically strip the the car seat in and have it secure on the seat because this baby right here is gonna do that for us um maybe i will unbox it too and just show you guys how it works but yeah let's get into the unboxing okay guys so overall this has been said to be a very good car seat as well i don't think i gave you guys much information but also another thing that stood out for me is that it's got aircraft approval. As you guys know, I usually travel between Joburg and Cape Town a lot. And that's always going to be the case for when baby is here. 
so I don't need to stress about using your regular three in one um, using using your regular three in one travel system type of things where I need to move baby out of um, car seat and onto the stroller frame and all that stuff so this is sort of like a one piece um, that just makes life easier man and obviously if I'm also traveling that way that means that wherever I go with the baby I know the baby is basically forever gonna be in their car seat whether we are in an uber or we are using somebody else's car or whatever the case may be so that's one thing that also stood out for me and also obviously the safety features of it that's another thing so it says here to have baby safe materials fail safe mechanisms side impact protection anti-rebound protection and obviously it's like european certified i don't think anybody would buy a stroller that's not certified in any way to be safe to use but yeah i keep talking a lot guys let me just quickly get into this vlog not vlog man i'm going into this unboxing so i got this of take a lot the supplier is duna but i don't know guys i am not impressed with how the box is looking so far it's as if i don't know somebody tried to open it or it was in the warehouse for too long or whatever the case may be but let's just open and see what it looks like inside and if nothing is damaged so that if anything is wrong then i still have more than enough time to basically return it recording this video is proving to be a nightmare guys but yet again this is reality right this is reality um if you're not a youtuber now you know just how difficult it is to just create this content and try to get it out there but thank you guys for bearing with me i'm back in my room because there was just way too much noise in the garage and it was just annoying me as well so yeah, I'm gonna figure out how to do this unboxing in my room. Um, there's the stroller down there. Oh yeah, and I haven't shown you guys. Ooh, see what I mean? I haven't shown you guys my bump in a while. That's where we at now. <laughs> so yeah. Now, like for real, let us get into this unboxing. show you quickly they just basically tell you that it is made of bamboo charcoal fiber and then it comes with a which I think is very cool the vehicle seat protector this is what you put on your seat before you put the car seat base or before you put the the, 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 the stroller itself onto the onto the seat um yeah and i've seen a lot of people in malls with this i don't know guys <laughs> and children apparently love it there um oh yeah and this is my registration what what to register this stroller just in case there are recalls or for warranty and all the stuff 
and there's the user guide but yeah let me just show you guys how it operates i'm already in love with it i think it goes perfectly with my interior <laughs> what do you guys say i love it guys like geez but anyway let me just show you guys how it turns into a stroller it is currently in its car seat format so i'm just gonna change it to a stroller for you guys basically if you look at the back here there's a release button so what you're supposed to do is if you have the baby up like this let me just try bring the I don't think it'll work though. Oh, I get off because I can move this up. If you just move this, I can move this. If you just move this to the front like that, and say I'm holding the baby this way out of the car, right? I just have to press that, and then the wheels are out, and I'm ready to go with the baby like that see Aww. like that and it's so easy to maneuver guys so so easy to maneuver see what i mean and then obviously when we get back to the car i can just put this back in Take this backwards or put it in the middle, move it in the middle like that. Go back to the button and then I can just hold it like that. And we're back to our car seat. So yeah, I'm sure you guys can understand why I went for this. Yeah, guys, so I just absolutely believe that it's the transformer of, <laughs> of strollers or car seats. Like, it just literally makes life so much easier. And actually, their slogan is parenting made simple. I absolutely agree with it. Listen, if it's going to make my life easy and going to keep my child less, less agitated in terms of having to move around and all that stuff, I, I want it. I'm taking it. And that's the main reason why I also got it as well, besides the space issue. But yeah, so now there's multiple pluses for me, for us rather. Number one, I don't have to stress about my boot being full of um, baby stuff, especially the pram, because it's always going to be in one place, which is where the baby seats all the time. And I just have to take her out, pop the wheels out, and we are ready to go with baby girl so whew, i'm so tired guys i feel like i worked overtime for this video i worked overtime guys but it's fine we move so yeah that's 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 it guys that is the Duna stroller um there are quite a number of reviews online on it if you want to watch it i can also share that one of the downfalls though of it is that obviously your child can't use it for life it is an infant car seat which means that um we will only use it up until she's about 12 months but then when i look at the, when i looked at the cost of me getting the duna versus me getting a three-in-one travel system um and the practicality of of that for me the duna still won because one, um, for example, if I wanted to get a Chilino Bella or a Nula Bug, I won't lie, those were my two other options. Um, I was going to get a three-in-one travel system with a carrier cart and, um, what do you call it? The carrier cart, the infant car seat and the toddler seat. Um, and I feel like it's only useful once the child is a toddler because for as long as the child is in the car seat, that means that I will always have to put the pram frame in the boot and i don't have space for that right and then i oh i'm always also going to have to um have to take the pram frame out and then take the baby out to the car seat and then put the baby on the frame and then we move and then when we come back from shopping same story all over again like so that for me was not practical 
so that's how i ended up with the duna and also a prime frame really takes up space i'm gonna insert a picture here to show you my friend that has a similar card to mine and has the nula bug what it looks like when the frame is in the boot guys so that was not about to be my life i refused from day one i was like this is not going to be my life give me zero ma'am yo i sorry guys this phone and it's small memory anyway so yeah i was saying give me zero ma'am so yeah but anyway that's how we ended up um deciding on the duna stroller baby girl and i so yeah i hope you guys really enjoyed this video i know i was all over the show with it but i feel like i gave you guys the important stuff that you needed to know and to note when it comes to especially to having to think and choose your stroller if you have a big car by all means go for all your fancy nice strollers your hot moms your you know go for it honey if you have space but mina personally as an individual that's forever on the road i do not have space honey so the duna works out perfectly for me and also it was just the dream stroller because it's so compact so trendy i just love it it just screams amo and donut so yeah hope you guys love this video um and yeah i can't wait to see you guys in my next one i'm gonna be doing a lot of unboxings of baby's big items i hope you're excited as i am to unbox them but yeah until the next time guys bye